Hi, I'm Jenny Macklis, Holistic Life Coach and Meditation Teacher. Welcome to our mini meditation series. Today we're going to talk about the importance of grounding. I know you've heard the word often, about people telling you how important it is to be grounded, but now I want to uh, introduce the idea of you considering it like a meditation. It's a type of meditation because it's actually a practice of mindfulness. So being grounded is about being present to all the parts of your being, body, mind, and spirit. So many people think of groundedness as a connection to the earth, which is absolutely fine. That is a helpful an analogy. I love the analogy of a tree. So when I think of a tree, how it reaches to the sky with its branches, and it goes down deep into the earth with its roots, the rootedness is the groundedness we're talking about. We can do that as people by grounding our energy, not only to the earth, but by simply being aware of the densest part of our being. Our body, mind, and spirit are all different dimensions of who we are, and being grounded is being connected to the densest part of our being, our physical body. The idea that when we have connection to our physical body, we're uh, offering a container for all the other components of body, mind, and spirit to be housed in. So grounding is important because what we're doing here is saying, here is my foundation, my structure. I'm here in my physical form. And this physical form is offering me the opportunity to experience life as a human. So let's take a moment to look at and experience what groundedness might be like. So for some people, it's this idea of going into a place of an imagining energetic roots, connecting through your tailbone or the bottoms of your feet, all the way down through the floor, down through into the earth, just like a tree with its roots. That's one great way to be grounded. Another way is to just notice on an internal level, the flow of energy or bringing your awareness down from your mind and down into your body to your lower energy centers, to your hips, to your feet, to your legs. And by being aware of your body in that way and by directing your energy downward, it gives you the opportunity to be more connected to the physical component of who you are. In other words, being more present to that part of you, that groundedness part of you, allows you access to all the parts. So I like to think of it as, sometimes I talk about it as the bookends, of begin something like the day or a project or a meeting with grounded presence and end it, conclude it, complete it with, a, with grounded presence there as well. A beginning and end, just like the bookends that we used to use on a bookshelf. So see if you can do that now. Just take a couple breaths, bring your awareness into a grounded presence. Feel the presence, feel the stillness. Let go of everything else just for a few breaths. And bring your awareness to your body. You're likely sitting now as you're listening to this. So bring your awareness to your posture, to your sitting posture, to your feet connected to the floor if you're standing, or your feet resting on the floor if you're sitting, to your body being supported by the chair, and just feel a presence of groundedness in your physical body. Take a few breaths as you become aware of that physical presence and that groundedness and start to allow it to flow, just like the breath does. But instead of allowing any uh, detachment from the physical, stay in your body. Stay grounded in your body for the next three breaths of our exercise. Feeling your physical body. Feeling your body supported by the chair. Feeling your feet connected to the earth, to the energy of the earth, of the physicality of your being. 
be here now in your body. Enjoy the experience of all of you. Practice that throughout your day. Until next time, many blessings. <laughs>